to our dear adjudicators, members of the faculty, audience, and to my fellow debaters, a greetings of joyous afternoon to all of us. Ladies and gentlemen of this body, considering the earlier stated arguments preferred before you by the opposition side, i.e. the constitutional angle that should be considered as it is violative, it Amen. is violative of right to life, liberty, and property clause of the fundamental and the paramount law of the land. The unacceptable nature of giving incentives to meet citizens since it is not beneficial, not necessary, and simply not practical enough. I also want to, re to reiterate that this proposition would not solve the status quo. Again, it would not solve the status quo. We have, we have presented this body sustainable development plans and alternatives um, that will surely cater to all the needs of our citizens. It would eventually be beneficial on the part of both government and its constituent. The idea of change, the idea of change that is... Wait. The idea of change that is more practical at the same time the negative effect of it, in which it will cause a rapid decline in um, fertility rate of a developing country, and the success of the country will continuously rise in the hands of future generations, as it was mentioned by our deputy of leader of opposition. My dear adjudicators, we on the opposition side strongly believe that we should win this debate, since the government side was not able to present stronger, reliable, and concrete propositions. The arguments stated by the government side was mere, were, merely a present, were merely a product of vague, fallacious, and ambiguous statements that remains to be just a claim. Ladies and gentlemen, we on the opposition side were able to lay down this body a logical, sound, and well-founded arguments that is backed with legal basis of the 1987 Constitution and accurate and reliable data coming from both Philippine and international context for better understanding. By all means, looking at the proposition from all angles, it simply must fail and it simply it should. Therefore, that's why financial incentives given to citizens are just waste of government funds. Right. They should be used as financial and, and support in upgrading healthcare facilities and to provide quality education to everyone. Ladies and gentlemen, children are the most valuable, valuable resources not only to their parents but to country itself. Therefore, we on the opposition side must be declared as the victor. Money, uh, money alone cannot make any difference. And for that, we were, uh, and for that, I have never been prouder to oppose. Thank you.